Hi, my name is Sandy Carter and I'm IBM's Vice President of Social Business Evangelism. And thank you so much for joining us again today for our weekly Social Business Coffee Break. The subject that I chose today comes out of that IBM study looking at over 2,000 companies around the world and seeing different factoids about what is driving people to social business. So what I'd like to do today is kind of talk through some of those prime motivators of how companies are making that choice to go to become a social business. So number one on that list with, again, over 2,000 companies is employee collaboration. Now, this one was almost 60% of the companies that we talked to. And I find this in particularly interesting because last year when we did the study, the number one reason was marketing, demand generation, outreach. And what we're seeing, and I've seen this around the world as I traveled, is that more companies are saying, you know what, let me try this out inside my corporation first. Let me understand how it works, get my teams all trained up on it, and then I'll take that plunge to customer service or sales or marketing externally. So over 60% of you this year are going to take the plunge into becoming a social business internally with collaboration. The second most demanded reason for becoming a social business was effectively finding a good, a service, or a person much more effectively through the area of social networking. So if you think about that, it's quite interesting because we have so much information, so many places to go, that ability to find the right person in customer service. Or if you're looking about products, the ability to find that right person, or even internally, to find that right expert is so very uh, crucial. So I do see this as the number two reason, number two motivation, that companies are going to social business. If you look at number three, number three reason that people are really looking to become a social business is around that idea of crowdsourcing and ideation. And in fact, over 40% of companies said, you know what, crowdsourcing is something that can really add a lot of value to my business. If we look at the latest McKinsey study, it really backs that up. It says that companies who do crowdsource products and services, whether new or doing a tweak, are actually 20% more successful than those that do not. So those are the top three motivators and the top three reasons that we've seen from companies around the world of why you would want to become a social business. So this is Sandy Carter. Again, I want to thank you so much for your time and I hope this study has been very valuable for you. Thank you very much.